Goodbye Toes. I was 17 years old. I was a senior in high school. I had just gotten over three cancer operations, one major one, where I had taken a lot of my flesh out, my muscle out from my arm. And, and uh, I was just getting back to where I could ride my motorcycle. I was so excited to ride my motorcycle. I wasn't able to wrestle anymore after the halfway through the season. I then um, started into, I may have been into track or just before track. I think it was just before track started. And my buddies wanted to go out, Jed, Ed, Kirk. I can't remember everybody that went out, but we went out West 12th Street all the way out to the where you have to stop. There's a gate out there. I think it was a gate and there was kind of a gravel pit and then you got in and you could ride the gravel pit and then shoot out of the gravel pit and ride out between the mountains and you go onto the salt flats, kind of where the salt lake had shrunk and there was still kind of a salt, salty, um, a salty surface, but it was kind of a mud and you could, you could go really quite fast and drive and it was, it was really fun. Anyway, we came in out of that. We came in uh, and I was coming back uh, from that from that trip and the other guys, I don't know where they were in front of me or back of me, but I went to go down into that gravel pit and as I was going down to that gravel pit, somebody was coming up off of a jump. He came out of the, and as he jumped, he was right in my face. He jumped right at me. So I turned my bike to the right, laid it down, and then he landed on my foot peg where my foot was and threw and shoved the foot peg of the motorcycle up through my wimpy McDonald's uh, shoes that I had. They were just kind of old shoes and anyway cut my two toes off. So not the big one but the other two and they cut them right off and just just they were just sort of hanging in the sock there. So it was really painful like somebody had taken a hammer and just smash hit your toes as hard as they could. It was horrible. Anyway we got we got we we headed to the hospital I laid in the back of the truck. They took me there to the hospital and I was laying there and they were going to get the plastic surgeon. His name was Dr. Bajera, a really nice guy. And he became the, he was the plastic surgeon. He came down and my mother was called at work. She came over from work. Thank goodness I wasn't hurt any worse than I was. I just cut off my two toes, but she, she held my hand and she held my hand through the procedure where they trimmed the, they cut the bones and they reattached the, the, the toes on and everything. I had to have more surgery another surgery later on but anyway they got them you know mostly attached uh, one is pretty short it's about half length and the other one's about two-thirds length or th uh, three-fourths length but anyway um, she held my hand during uh, the removal and the cleaning up and the fixing and repairing of my toes um, it hurt pretty bad but what I remember mostly was she was crying during that time because when I was holding her hands and her fingers, I was so in so much pain and stress that I was crushing her fingers. I was squeezing them so tight that she was crying because it was hurting her, but she said nothing. Man, she was a great mom. 